Hi there, I'm Karen Cox, the broker of record at CNC Realty, and I am here to give you the latest on the local real estate market in Gray County and our immediate area. So thank you for joining me for our April 2023 real estate market update. Spring is trying to bloom in Gray County, but old man winter doesn't seem to want to let it go quite yet. Currently, across Gray County, there are 268 new listings for the month of April, which is an increase of 18% over March. The listing to sales ratio continues to trend more heavily in the favor of listings and was 70 to 30 this month. There were 124 sales in April, the same as in March. The average number of days on the market continues to drop and was seven days shorter than last month. Before we get into all of that, if you watch and enjoy this video, please let us know by giving it the thumbs up. And if you have any questions, drop a comment below. Now let's get back to the market update. A look back to 2022 shows relative stability in the number of new listings for April of each year, with 2023 just 6% lower than 2022, and the sales continue to be lower this year, we're down 23%. The average sale price for a Gray County home rose 15% in April compared to March, but was 18% lower than in April of 2022. In Gray County, the average home took 46 days to sell, seven fewer than last month, but three times as long as in April of 2022. Now, when we look at the months of inventory on hand across the county, it remains at four, the same as in March but just two months of inventory were available for sale at this time last year. So for the latest information on what's happening in the real estate market in your part of Gray County, click the link in the caption for our April real estate market update. And if you'd like to see more videos like this one, then be sure to hit the subscribe button for more local real estate news and information for Gray County. And thank you for tuning in and we'll see you again next month.